Hi Rosie. Hello. Okay, this is uh, yacht Loose Cannon and we're motor sailing and we're about, well just short of halfway I guess between Gibraltar and Lanzarote where we're going. This is Rosie who's a last minute addition to the crew and has livened the place up no end because she's so bubbly. So introduce yourself uh, to uh, everybody Rosie. Um, hello, I'm Rosie, so yes. Um, I am really, really looking forward to going to the Caribbean with you lot and uh, love sailing a lot. <laughs> <laughs> okay, and how much sailing have you done? Um, well, I first went on a boat when I was six feet up, but um, no, I've done uh, down to the Canary twice and uh, around the And you've, you've crewed on super yachts and things, haven't you? Mm. So tell us about that. Yes. Um, it's lots of cleaning and seeing places, very, very, very beautiful places from afar. Um, yeah, looking at amazing islands while hoovering most of the time. But I um, managed to cross the Atlantic and go to Russia and see some very, very cool places. Okay, so we're just, we're just ordinary sailors here, but what are, what are the mega rich like? Um, lazy. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, no, very nice, very kind, um, you know, basically the same really, inspired to cross the Atlantic and got their own sailing dreams, places they want to be, places they want to really, really be, um, family orientated, but the same thing really. Okay, and yeah. tell, us, tell us how you found this trip so far, just talk us through, awesome. you know, leaving Gibraltar and all the things that have happened. Leaving Gibraltar, 12 hours, 30 miles, um, me puking over the deck. Um, now the sun's out, it's fantastic. Uh, just had uh, scrambled eggs for breakfast, so um, and then we can't push better. Yeah, the, the scrambled eggs were courtesy of our, our, our skipper, yeah, El Capitan. We're just, we're just going to put the camera onto El Capitan here. This, Hello. Is, this is Richard, who is the owner of Loose Cannon. And I met him in Licata in Sicily. He had his uh, wife and uh, son Josh on board then, but they had to go home for Josh's education and so on. And we're now trying to get the boat over to the Caribbean as part of uh, Richard's trip to get the boat all the way home to New Zealand. So um, tell us about your plans, Richard. Um, well, the first plan is to get through to the Caribbean, and that's when uh, my wife and uh, young son Joshua will uh, join us again. And uh, from there we'll do Caribbean through till about March, and uh, through to Panama, across the Galapagos, and through to Tahiti, and uh, from there through to Fiji, and either uh, straight on to Australia, or make the left hand turn down to the sea. Okay, and, and tell us about this boat, Loose Cannon. Uh, you've just recently bought her, so tell, tell us about the history of the boat, why, why you chose this boat, and so on. Um, well, the, the history of the boat is it was used for sail training in Croatia and um, I'd seen the boat on the net in New Zealand and had at one point decided to look at a Peneto 50, whereas this is a Peneto first range. Um, sail's a little quicker um, and this boat actually ended up having a better layout in terms of what we wanted to do. So with a little bit of racing background myself, I decided to go for a performance boat and um, it got the layout and so far we're very happy with the boat. It's been well maintained, um, having spent quite a bit of time in the charter industry myself, I guess uh, I knew what to look for uh, in terms of making sure we were getting a good boat. Okay, thanks. Well, I'm going to stop this video here because long videos take a long time to upload, but we'll, uh, we'll make some more on the trip and talk about chartering and how this trip goes and all sorts of things for some future posts. So, thanks Richard. And thanks, Rosie. Thank you.